Mac Extras. In this video, I'm just going to show you the rounded corner feature, the new feature in 17.1 from uh, Adobe and the Illustrator. Now, I've got some text here. I'm just going to apply it to text. And if you go to text, you have to actually expand it because it just won't be able to, to use the rounded corner feature. Now, just use the direct selection tool to actually get the rounded corner feature. And you will see these little dots appear. Now, to actually modify it, you actually, if you go and try and modify some of these, I'm just going to just drag it out. It actually just won't move. You think, well, that's great. Doesn't work. Not very really useful. And that's not very good. But you can actually just, as with all these things with the direct selection tool, you can just select one anchor point or just that one there. And now I can actually just drag that out. Obviously, it does require that you actually go through all these individually, but it just basically there's a limit to how far it could go, and it uses that as the the maximum, which is odd. I must admit, it's one of those things that you think, well, you should be able to drag it out all of them out as far as they can go. Unfortunately, it doesn't do that. It just goes to the the maximum of the weakest point in a sense. Okay, so you have to go through each of those individually. And I'm just going to go and quickly select another couple of ones there. There's some points there. And I'm just going to select that one. And I can just drag that out. Now, if I actually want to display the options, you go over, over here. Live corners, as it's called. Or rounded corners. Live corners. And basically you've got a few options. You've got inverted round, chamfer, and also radius. Now, you can actually use the radius here. So I'm just going to just modify it here. So you can also use the go down like that you obviously go there and you can actually just use the up and down arrow keys to modify it. and you can just see and it is live it can basically be edited at any point so but it will reach a certain point and that's it it won't go any further so that's how a quick way of rounding various parts of text hope you found this of interest thank you much